In this video, I will show you 10 unusual materials that you can engrave with a good laser engraver. I will be using my favorite laser engraver, the Sculptfun S9. The Sculptfun S9 has the most advanced optical system that compresses the laser light into a very small spot. Having a lot of energy concentrated on a very small surface results in high temperatures that can engrave all kinds of materials. The Sculptfun S9 is the only laser engraver in this price range that is capable of engraving all these special materials shown in this video. Number 1. Engraving the Ceramic Teacup Because the cup is tall, I have raised the machine with four rolls of duct tape. I will try to engrave this cute little snowman on the cup with the following settings. The engraving is deep, and it is very durable. Number 2. Let's try to engrave a glass cup. Glass is transparent and does not absorb the laser light. Therefore, before engraving, it is first needed to paint the surface black. I use cheap spray paint, but you can use black marker or watercolors or something that is easy to remove afterwards. Glass needs to be engraved at a slow speed and full power. I used cross hatching for filling the shapes. The edges will become crisper if you engrave the outline after filling. I removed the paint with acetone. Laser engraving produces a rough surface, similar to sandblasting. It is very durable. Number 3. You can use your laser engraver to make custom stickers. Text is engraved with low power which does not penetrate the paper, and the sticker outline is cut with full power. Number 4. Stainless Steel. Sculptfun S9 is one of the very few machines in this price range that can engrave stainless steel. It is not even needed to paint it black. For demonstration I will use a black marker and paint only half of the surface to be engraved. For stainless engraving, use slow speed for the best result. There is no difference between the painted and non-painted surface. This machine has a highly compressed spot. Other machines I have tested so far are nowhere near as powerful. Most of them don't mark the stainless steel even with a painted surface. Engraving is deep and durable. It does not come off easily with sandpaper.
Number 5. You can use this laser engraver for making custom jar lids for homemade products. Here is a little trick for positioning the piece perfectly every time. First, focus the laser on the top of the piece. Then remove the piece and engrave the circle in the size of the lid. You can see it in blue color. Then position the lid in the center and engrave your design. The alignment is perfect. Number 6. Stone Engravings. First let's try with black granite stone on which I tried to engrave a photo. The engraved surface becomes lighter in color, so the image must be engraved as a negative, which can be easily selected in the Lightburn software. The engraving came out very nice. Let's try to engrave a vector design with a crosshatch infill. Here are the settings. The smooth black stone produces the best results. Not every type of stone works well. The best results can be achieved with smooth, single color stones. The porous marble stone like this does not produce good results. I also tried to engrave a ceramic tile. Stone engravings are very deep and will last for a very long time. Number 7. This is a quick one. With a laser engraver you can easily make stencils for spraying paint. Masking tape is the best for this, since it is easy to peel off. I downloaded a stencil font from the internet. In the video description you can find links to all designs and Lightburn files shown in this video. Number 8. Leather. You can do a lot of beautiful engravings on real leather. Here I have a piece of an old 4mm thick piece of leather which I will try to engrave and cut.
Number 9. I tried to engrave a chromed whiskey hip flask. I painted the surface black, so the surface will absorb the laser light. Using full power, slow speed and cross hatching, the result came out very nice. Number 10. With a strong laser, you can engrave the backside of the mirror. This way, you can make some very awesome and personalized gifts. Don't forget to mirror the image. If you put some backlight behind the mirror, you can get a very cool effect. Check out the video description below for more information, or visit hobbylasercutters.com for more information about laser engravers.